sometimes someone will ask a question that we don't want to answer. Maybe the question feels too personal or inappropriate or answering will cause trouble. In this lesson, we look at two strategies for dealing with such questions, not answering and refusing to answer. Sometimes we can just refuse to answer. We might do this if we think the question is a little rude, but we only use the strategy if we know the other person well, like a family member or a close friend. What did you and Lisa argue about? I'm not saying. Well, I hope you clear it up. We might also do it a little playfully, like in this example. What did you get for my birthday? Don't be nosy! Oh, come on! No, be patient. Wait and see. However, often the best strategy is to avoid answering. Where were you this morning? Um, oh, you know. I had some things that I had to do. Oh? Yeah. Hey, I'm gonna make a coffee. Do you want one? Sure, thanks. What do you think about this new company policy? Uh, I don't know. I haven't really thought about it. What's your take on it? I think it's shocking, don't you? Um. Uh. Well, I'll need to think it through, I guess. Well, first they told us that... So, what happened in the meeting? Oh, you know, the usual stuff. Did they talk about my request? Um, yeah, I think it came up. What did they say? Oh. Well, I can't really remember details. Something about something. Maybe check with Jenny. She might remember. Okay. Sorry I'm not much help. No problem. The strategy and language we use to not answer or refuse to answer a question depends on how well we know the person asking. We hope you enjoyed this lesson. Remember, don't forget to watch our other video lessons on our Chasing Time English TV channel. We'll see you next time.